Coming up next, it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the floor. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponents. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. All right, so here he is, a man who needs no introduction. GSP, wildly popular, not just in his native Canada, but around the world. Many people, DC, believe, pound for pound, that George St. Pierre might be the greatest UFC fighter of all time. He is one of the greatest fighters of all time. If there was an MMA Mount Rushmore, George St. Pierre would be on everybody's list of top five fighters of all time. Just an ability to mix everything together. He was truly the evolution of mixed martial arts from the wrestling, the striking to the grappling. He was a guy that did everything and did everything well, and it made the level of mixed martial arts praise because everyone was trying to catch the SP. And I got good news right next to him on that Mount Rushmore. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. The American is 29, the Canadian is 39. He will have a one inch reach advantage. To get us started with the official introductions, we go inside to the veteran voice of the Octagon. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, eight losses, and one draw. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Brasilia Distrito Federal Brazil, Vicente the Silent Assassin, Luke and now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 26 wins, two losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Montreal, Quebec, Canada, George Rush St. P. Alright, grip the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly... Whoa! Oh, he might be out. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, straight right. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Big kick lands. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press it. He's got to go 
chase that finish down. Oh, he might be out. That uppercut did it. That one is going to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Powerful leg kick land. Just out of range with that right hook. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. That will land it clean. The one-two punch is true. Throwing haymakers out of the exchange. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Real quick leg kick. Oh, wow, those leg kicks are already taking effect. Oh! 